welcome back to another Trucker Tim trucking vlog. It is currently 10 to 6 in the morning. You find me in my truck. We're just getting set up in here. This is the yard. I was the last one in this morning. It shouldn't be as hot today. Yesterday it was 42 degrees. I didn't film yesterday. It was too hot for filming. Plus, my aircon has now decided to stop working in this lorry. I've got it on. Nothing. My previous lorry that had aircon issues, that stopped working. This one worked when we first got the truck not long ago, but it's decided to stop working. Hopefully, it just needs a regas, and that's something we can do. This morning, we're off to Bury St. Edmunds, a nice little local one. And yeah, I've got a few things to talk about. It's been an absolute crazy last 48 hours for me. We'll talk about it when we get heading up the road, but oh my God, it has all been going on. Later on, we're speaking to someone from the Daily Mail. <laughs> you know, the newspaper. Daily Mail, we're speaking to someone, an interview with a man from the Daily Mail. Yesterday, I had pictures for the article. I'm gonna be in the Daily Mail, basically. Bruce Edmonds is about an hour away. Let's just have a look. That's why I'm not starting so early. You can't get in there till seven. So, I'm not leaving till six. Uh, OIP three, one. Is anybody watching this from Bruce Edmonds or around the local area? Drop us a comment. Be good to find out drive stick out there we'll get the old steering wheel in position i've done my vehicle tech to get check to check check checks we'll have to nip and get some diesel today we've got just over a quarter of a tank so we might need a little bit of diesel i've got my lucasade set up better get the cb on i suppose hang on, hang on. Hey, there we go in case we get any followers want to have a little chat channel 19 guys Right, it's time to leave. So, this hat off, this hat on. Very good, very nice, very good, very nice. I see Joshy boys just turned up for work. Oh, here he is. Oh, they've cut all the trees here. Yeah, see that? Oh, hay fever's playing me up this morning. They've started combining. We'll have that, we'll have that. Let's go. I don't think we've been to Bury St Edmunds on the vlogs, have we? We have got a lot to talk about today, a lot to catch up on. It has all been kicking off. Oh. <gasps> Hello? Good morning, Trucker Tim here. Anybody on? I think I might have ruined my aerial, you know, guys. When we chopped it down. Yeah, great. Class 66! Class 66! Oh, what we got here? Oh, it's all kicking off. I'm stuck behind a tractor. There's a great big beet harvester. Tang for the beet harvester. Is that a beet harvester? Is that what it is? Potato harvester. I don't really know. Look at all them containers. Oh, my word. All right, we need to get by this tractor. I've been stuck behind this for ages now. Oh, good. It's going our way. Of course it is. Hopefully, we'll get it in a minute. I'll get it in a minute. Why are you stopping, tractor? They're indicating to come down here. Jesus. Read the road. It's probably about four years old in there. Go, yeah, go, 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 go. I might have this as well. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm going for it. Yeah, boy. We did it. Oh, they're supposed to resurface this road, but Jesus Christ! I think it's worse. I actually think it's worse. Or... God! Whoa, look out. Look out, Panda. Look out! Wow, nicely judged. Now, that's what you call reading the road. He read the road then. Or oh, he was looking at his phone. Didn't notice him pulling in there. Little dab of indicator here. Oh, I need to look at that. Bob's right when I've done my vehicle checks. Got an indicator gone somewhere. We'll look at that when we get to Bury St Edmunds. And we go down the slip road. Oh, looks like we've got a 40 mile an hour average speed check. Oh, thank you, Satnav, for advising me of that as well. Whoa, evergreen. Can we sneak in here between these two? 
Oh, he's moved over. Good lad. Good lad. Thank you. I think we're gaining on this old boy here. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. I've stepped out. It's gonna be a slow old process, this is. Look at all the lorries. Hmm. There's a little bit of a hill here, so I'm hoping maybe that one of these up here is loaded and slow him up. I'm not going to be very popular with the cars behind. Might get some abuse when I finally pull in. Oh, he's eased off a little bit for me, this Tang has. He's flashed me in, good lad. Sorry, 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 sorry. So sorry for keeping you. So then, as I execute another overtaking maneuver. Jesus, what's he got in there? God. Yeah, so anyway, yeah, in the last four hours, absolute chaos. So if you follow me on TikTok, you would have seen my bath in the cab TikTok. Well, that went absolutely viral. And I've had the BBC on. So I had a little bit of done, a bit of little news article for their website done, okay? And then off the back of that, we had ITV this morning ring me up. The Daily Mail, which I spoke about earlier, which is actually happening today. The bloke from the Daily Mail is coming to give me an interview. I'll see if he wants to be on the vlog. He probably won't, but we will ask. Yesterday I had the, pre the press, yeah, basically the press, that they come out and take took photos of me, actually. Loads of photos of me in the truck, the tang hat, the tones, the CB and everything. I was giving all the tangs. So yeah, that's gonna be funny to get a tang on the Daily Mail, in the Daily Mail. But yeah, Radio 5 Live, I was on there the, yesterday morning. I was on Radio 5 Live talking about it all uh, and how I've inspired people. I was on Radio 2 as well, as some of you may have heard. On the early morning breakfast show, went on there. They had like a whole feature about Trucker Tim. He yeah, was talking about me and what I'm doing and everything and asking if there was anybody out there who I've inspired. And there's people ringing in and talking about me. Like, what? I was driving up the A1, I was going to Leeds actually with a hook loader. And I was just like, they're talking about me. Such a weird feeling. And then in the midst of all that, I was filming the previous video with the Scania card here, if you want to watch that. It's actually not too bad, not as bad as I thought it was going to be. A lot of work to be done, obviously. I wasn't expecting it to be like perfect underneath and, you know, straight into customising. So the next stage with the Scania is it's going to be going to be shot blasted next. So we'll get it shot blasted and that'll reveal any other stuff that needs addressing, obviously, once all the paint's been blasted off it. And then back to Lombardo's where we filmed the other day and it'll have everything fixed. Then to back to Transtech, where it'll have to be fabricated with all the infield side skirts and everything else. And then from there to paint and airbrushing, then back to Transtech for all the electrical work. And then we should be good. Yes. Take it to truck shows and everything. It's gonna be awesome. Cannot wait. <laughs> Love it. Chuck a left here. And then a right here. Around we go. Diddly O. God, what's that? Nice and wide here so we don't get that cut up. Oh, nicely done. Plenty of room there, Timbo. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Hello. It's been a long while since I've been here. Come to collect cardboard. Oh, it's Trucker Tim, yeah? Trucker Tim? Right, mate, have you been here before? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, oh, mate, yeah, I'll let you in. Cheers, mate. <laughs> follower. <laughs> oh, follower. Answered the intercom. Right, we'll wait here a minute. Just waiting to get on the way bridge. The way bridge hut is there. We've got these two Fred Sherwoods in front of us. They'll weigh in and go in, then we'll put on the way bridge. Weigh in, speak to the follower, if there's him in there, and then uh, go around and get loaded. Time to move up. We have to go nice and wide here, nice and wide, to get on the way bridge. It's quite 
彩。喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，喂，Okay, lights sorted out. Yeah, they're on it. Wired up. <laughs> they're on. You've got to give us some tunes. I'll give you some tunes. I think we've got to do an induction. <sighs> I'll just have a quick look, but I don't think I have. Hang on. You got some? Oh! Result. Look at that! Yeah, that's all right <laughs> <laughs> I'll just put my curtain round. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> I gotta get changed. What a palaver. You're not allowed shorts on in here. Here we go. All changed. Is this what moves the mail? Yeah, no problem. <clears throat> no problem, thank you. In we come. Oh, you've been watching me as well, have you? I don't know if there's anybody that in. Just started loading now. This is what we're cutting in all this cardboard. I'll just open the curtains up. So yeah, you'll put a few on, then I'll have to get out, pull some straps over, and then get back in, put a few more on, pull some straps over, and do it like that, because you're not allowed out of the cab while they're loading. Fred Sherwood's pulling on. Very good, very nice, very good, very nice. Okay, so we've got three rows on. Now we need to get three straps over. One. So then as you can see down this side, we've now got another three on and I've put another three straps over. Just got the back to do, the last two or three rows. And then we'll come and strap all of these up. Oh, hard hat off. We're nearly loaded now. Okay, so that's us fully loaded up. Now I need to strap up. Let's crack on with strapping up. Four more to do, and then we can crack on. Oh, hate it when it happens. There we go. We are loaded up. And trucking. We're not trucking yet, but we're definitely loaded up. Let's get this off. Oh, it's getting hot out there already. I want to put my shorts back on. Back that truck up. Oh. Oh, it fixed itself. I, nope. There's a dodgy connection somewhere. I forgot to look at that indicator. We better pull over and do that, haven't we? Cheers. Tim, give us a tone. Gave us some tones. Did you hear him on the radio? Tim, give us some tones. Yeah, I've got it data shredder. Um, I'll leave the barrier, come round for your ticket. Okay, lovely, thank you. So now I have to go around all the way around the one way system now to get our Weybridge ticket. I need to be back at March Yard, get unloaded, in, and across to the other yard for half 11, because I believe that's when the Daily Mailman is meeting me at the other yard. Very tight way bridge. Ooh, ooh. If you want this yeah, the radio, radio you're gonna put the tag in the box that's it. <laughs> put the tag in the box, and that's my ticket. Yep. Thank you very much. Right. Out we go. Give us some tones. I've got to put this tag in the box. I'll show you that quick. This is the tag. Thank you, bye. So she's seen me put the tag in the box, and now she should raise the barrier. You raise me up. There it goes. Hi, mate. Is that a nightmare being so famous? Yeah, it is a bit, yeah. <laughs> you and Ollie Bloggs, the farmer bloke. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. He's called Ollie Bloggs. He does loads oh, of does he? farming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, oh, yeah, that's awesome. Go. So was it a pain in the ass going like truck festival? Yeah, mate, you couldn't believe it. The amount of people. That sort really? of come over, yeah. I'll tell you Did what, you look. Pay for it there, then, or? 
Yeah, I'll do. I'll get paid for YouTube, yeah. Look, I've got your sticker for you. Oh, he'd love it. There you go. <laughs> get your sticker. I better have a picture yeah. of your, your star. No worries, Thank mate. you very much. What you got in there today? A bath, shower, toilet? No, nothing today. <laughs> Just for... you got a bath Yeah. Oh, well, good to see you anyway. Yeah, so. nice to see you, mate. Yeah, you see you later. Yeah. <laughs> he watches the vlogs. Hello, mate. Nice to meet you. I'll surprise him. I don't think he knew I was filming. Surprise! Fred Sherwood's coming back in for another one. Woohoo! We're off. Let's go. That's where we just loaded up over there. Awesome. Nice to meet you, lads. Give him a couple of times. <laughs> I love that one. So we've got just over 24 ton on. Echo tones. 24 tons off from the lights. More than 24 tons with the weight of the truck. Up the drag. Get on. I love it, I do. I say it all the time, but I actually do love it. Let's find a lay by, check out what indicator's not working, and change my trousers. Let's, let's just have this one. Oh, it's not doing it now. It's saying the indicator's fine. Oh, there's definitely a dodgy connection somewhere. Woo! Crack on, boy. Right, let's change me trousers. Oh. We're all sorted up now. Let's try the indicator again. It's saying the indicator's fine now. Who knows? Well, it's working now, we won't check it. We'll just keep our eye on it. It's something we've got to keep our eye on. Back to the yard. Now we've got to get out of here. Go! What I usually do is stick the hazards on now, because I'm obviously going very slow. It's going to take me a while to get wound up. 20 rounds, give me a tang! But just having the hazards on for this little bit just makes people aware that I'm slow moving so they don't crash up my backside. Oh, I think we can turn them off now. <sighs> trucking time and off the brakes turn her in on the accelerator indicate off look left look right look left and accelerate out indicator off 10 to 2 check check go guess a couple of tones hang on someone's broke down here Check the mirror, a little bit of indicator. We're all good, nice wide berth. Check the mirror there. Pass safely back in, 10 to two, and continue the tones. So much different when you're loaded, because like, you can pass your class one, with no weight on the trailer at all, just empty, pass, and then the next day you can go out at 44 ton. And it's a completely different ball game when you've got like that much weight on. Truck handles completely different. Here comes Harris, Tang for Harris. Hope you enjoyed that. I'm just gonna give a couple of little, you know. <laughs> So we'll get this unloaded, then get back across to the other yard and meet up with the Daily Mail man and have a little chat with him, see what we've got to say. We're back at the yard. Here we are. We're back. We're back. Let's find Josh. 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 Now, we don't need to go on the way bridge because... Oh, well, I'll wait. We don't need to go on the way bridge because obviously we wade in and out at the collection point. It's all right. But we do need to go over the way bridge to get into the yard. Because I do believe we are unloading in the main yard just here. So let's pull on in, see what's happening. See what it's all about. Oh God, my old lorry's in here. Oh God. Oh, right, let's go and uh, take the paperwork in and see what's happening here. Because it's a bit busy in here. And now that lorry wants to get on where I am. Oh, what day. Yeah, Mum. He's going to back up a bit so I can drive around there. 
is nearly done. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is us. Bosh, bosh, bosh. Pucker pies. Here's Josh. How are you? Yeah, I'm right, you? No. No? Why, what's up? I'm waiting for some chain to be delivered. It's not here yet. How's your new shed? It's good, actually. <laughs> hey, it Pucker pies. Yeah. They're sending us some. Oh. Do you want one? Yes. We'll do it in the microwave. Getting it unloaded. Christoph! Yes. YouTube! Wow! Good? Good! Say subscribe! Yeah? Say subscribe! Ah! Yeah? yeah? Or not? Not got a clue. Hey, yeah. Sweep this off. One more stack to go. Messy old job, this one. Thank you. Get this swept off, do the curtains up, and then get down the other yard. See my man from the Daily Mail. Let's go. She's on. Get this off. Get down to the other yard. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so sweaty right now. Aircon's not working either. Something I need to get sorted, that is. I'll tell you what we'll do. We're about half an hour early for the uh, Daily Mail man. He's gonna be there at half eleven. It's now eleven o'clock. So we'll nip in. I hope you can hear me over all the noise. We'll nip in and get some diesel from here. Go get some diesels. I still haven't received any stickers yet from you guys. Come on, my PO box is in the description. Send me some stickers for the truck. Diesel top. While I'm standing here dieseling up, I've just had a thought. There's not much room down the other yard, and if they're busy with trucks, I'm going down there just for an interview. Maybe I shouldn't right, take my trailer. I wasn't going to clog up the yard. Hmm. Might go back and take the trailer off. Yeah, we'll go and do that. If not, it's going to be chaos. We'll go back to the yard, dump the trailer, and then go down there. Didn't really think about that until just now. <laughs> Does anybody know if you can remove anti-siphon things out of diesel tanks? Because look at the mess it makes. See it all splashing back. No matter what you do. Is there a way of taking them out? So I want to take it out. Let me know in the comments if you know. I ain't got a clue. Well, that's 700 quid. Probably nearly there now. Oh, there we go. Bosh. 774 quid, 387 litres. Cash. Let's go pay. There she is, full of juice. Right. Let's go and get rid of this trailer. Here we go then. Go left, go wide, watch your trailer swing. <laughs> You've got your right indicator on. I mean left. Thank you. Yeah, boy! Woohoo! We'll say thank you to her or him behind, can't remember. Got a full tank of diesel. Three quarters of a tank of Ablu. I'm shouting loudly so you can hear me, hopefully. It's just too hot in here to not have the window down a bit. What we'll do, we'll just leave you on point of view while we drop the trailer. And then you get an idea of what happens. We're going in. She's going in nice. Take the lock off, Tim. Watch the curb. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, but... You know. Dee 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 dom dee dee dee. Yep. Ah. Right, let's drop this quick. There we go. Legs. Put them away as we're travelling. We'll put them away.
Get that on there. There we go. Right, we're now trailer free. Oh, well, it will be in a minute. Low of suspension, hazards off. Perfect. Level of suspension back out with this green button here. We've now got her on ride height and we can go. Woo! Woo -hoo! We're bobtailing again. It's the second time we've bobtailed on the vlog. Second time bobtailing on the vlog. You watch how quickly it pulls out of here. You watch this. I'm in automatic mode. We're going to pull away in fifth gear. I don't know if you can see that. Go. Foot flat, foot flat. Oh, a little bit of wheel spin. And we're off. Tang for GB. Woo! 50, just like that. Bobtail tones. <laughs> That's nice color, I like that. I'm just thinking about the marker lights. So the last video was the Scania update. And the video before that was the vlog we put the marker lights on and we hadn't got them wired up. But they are actually wired up now. I haven't shown you guys today yet. I don't know if you can see them in the mirror. Forgot to show you earlier. I can't remember where we went this morning. Oh yeah, Bury St Edmunds. <laughs> it all rolls into one. They're on now because they're on with the daytime running lights. Looking good. I do wish I'd got some that stuck out a bit more though. Because you can't quite see them that well, especially when you've got a trailer on. Here's the hook loader that we go out in. Hey, here we are. I'd like to get my lorry at wash, really. I don't know if that would be possible while we're here. Gate shut. Let's see if we can give this a quick swill off while we're here. Let's give it a quick swill. Oh, my gloves have just jumped out of the cab. I suppose we better do the windows up first. Gotta shut the gates. Take a good press that. You? Now, I've never used this before. Whoa. I don't know how it works. Whoa. That is awesome. Hello, just keep trying to spring yourself back in. There's soap. I think Daily Mail are here. I think they've arrived. I think they're in the office. Ah! It's all going on today. <laughs> I think that'll do me. Looking good. Let's get tidied up and see if we can see the Daily Mail anywhere. There she is, all clean. Looking fresh. Check her out. Looking good. Clean that tank off. That was bad earlier, wasn't it? Right. This is the man from the Daily Mail. Hey, He's just hi. done an interview with me. We've just finished the interview, haven't we? Yeah, for many, it went well. many hours. It's many been, hours. So this has been, it's been going on for over an hour, hasn't it? It's awesome. So yeah, Daily Mail on Saturday. I'll put a link in the description to the video, to the uh, article. We'll do that. Brilliant. Okay, let's head back to the yard then. That was an awesome interview there with the chap from the Daily Mail. I'm looking forward to seeing that. It's going to be on the internet and in the newspaper as well. Apparently, it's going to be a two-page spread in the Daily Mail. What the flip? <laughs> yeah, it was absolutely awesome. Telling him all about. Basically all about my life and everything. <laughs> he wanted to know all the ins and outs. I've got a lovely clean truck as well. Woohoo! Get some tones! Oh, I didn't give him any tones, did I? That's a shame. He'd have loved that. So now it's just a case of getting back to the yard, getting hooked up again, back to my trailer, finding out where we're going tomorrow. And we do it all over again. Another awesome day in the life of Trucker Tim. I love it.
absolutely love it. My aircon has actually stopped working now, but we're going to get that fixed tomorrow. Oh, combining. Right, let's go find a trailer. Oh, 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 oh. We're back. There she is. She's in there. Look, hidden between these two. Hello. And do you know the good thing about that interview? I had like an hour and a half interview and I actually got paid for it. <laughs> from data shredders, not from the Daily Mail, unfortunately. All right, let's squeeze in here. Oh, boom, we're in. Oh, we a lot of room here. Whew. Truck is looking fresh. Look at her. Oh, drop me glove. Clip in. <sighs> ABS. Like that. Legs. Legs 11. Look how shiny. Look how she look. Compared to this one, look how shiny she looks. Very good, very nice. Hello, sexy banana. Back of the cab's looking clean. Oh, I don't know if you noticed as well, I changed tops because I had to have some pictures taken. I'd put my data shredder stuff on. I didn't have one, so I had to go and get one out of the stock room. Trailer could do a wash now already, couldn't it? I'll be last out tomorrow, I do believe. I have got to start to about quarter past five, half five tomorrow again. That'll be good. Let's get in. Let's see if we can give somebody a shout out. Let's have a little look through here. So here we go. Let's give this person a shout out. They've sent me a few messages. So this Andrew Martin Caps, I think that's how you say it petrolhead underscore andy so he's basically messaged me saying let's see if i can get a shout out i start my class one training on friday thank you for the motivation to keep going tim and this emoji no worries andrew hope it goes well mate hope you get on all right i'm sure you'll smash it let me know in the comments or send me a um oh, who's this hello yes yeah, trucker tim is it to a po box or hmm i don't even know I don't know what that is. Well, thank you very much. Cheers, mate. Thanks, Pete. That was my FedEx man. <laughs> the FedEx man was like, all right, Trucker Tim. <laughs> so he must be a follower as well. Anyway, if you're watching this, mate, thanks for leaving my parcel in a safe place. Right, uh, where were we? Yeah, Andrew Martin Caps, petrolhead underscore Andy. Go give him a follow on Instagram. He's doing his class one training this Friday. Hope it goes well, mate. Well, actually, as you're watching this, you've already done it. So I hope it went well. And yeah, let me know in the comments how you got on or send me a message on Instagram. Let me know. Hope it goes well, mate. I'm just going to mop my brow with this sweaty top I've been wearing today. <sighs> hate this hot weather. Actually hate the heat, despise it. Get me bag packed. Get me paperwork. Done did. Get the Tang hat back on. Where is my paperwork, actually? I had to move everything in the cab because of old matey doing his interview. Oh, here's my colleague now that we passed earlier. He's now got the trader on. I wonder where he's been with that. We have took that out on a vlog, but not with a skip on the back. We've took the trailer out on a vlog, but not with a skip on. God, dust. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this Trucker Tim vlog. I didn't film much with the uh, Daily Mail man because it was quite full on, lots of questions and all that sort of stuff. Oh, God, that back axle. That must be the ground. Look at the front axle, then look at the back axle. Oh, look, there we go. It was just the ground. She's really long. I thought it was really long. That video, actually, I'll put a card here if you want to watch me driving that with the trailer on. But not with a skip on, but yeah, it's really, really, really long. I thought it was illegal. But yeah, really hope you enjoyed this vlog, guys. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you did, you can also give it a thumbs down. I'm not too worried. And please leave a comment because I read all of your comments and give you all a little heart to say I've read it. So yeah, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Put the little bell icon on as well so you don't miss any updates on the Scania. I'll speak to you on the next video anyway, guys. Cheers!